Hi, I want to wish you a blessed new year. This season, I've got a perfect gift for you. It's my new book titled, The Invitation, or The Call of God. Everyone who comes to this earth has a purpose. Are we here just to build houses? Are we here just to marry? What happens when we die? When you don't have answers to these questions, you can live life with a feeling of emptiness and hollowness. This book will show you why God brought you into this world, what you're supposed to do. Get one for yourself, get one for a friend. It will be a blessing to you. God bless you and have a blessed new year. Place your order on Facebook by posting or messaging the title, Invitation. We also deliver worldwide. This message is brought to you by the friends and partners of Kakra Baden. Welcome to Air Power with Kakra Baden, teaching the nations with signs and wonders. Kakra is the senior pastor of the Morning Star Cathedral, Lighthouse Chapel International, Accra, Ghana. Now, today's message. Welcome. Kakra continues his teaching on the subject, greatness. Yesterday, he explained that the blessing of God brings revelation and fruitfulness. Today, he explains two more effects of the blessing of God. Number four. He said, I will make your name great. A good name is a sign of the blessing of the law. Ecclesiastes 7.1, it says, a good name is better than precious ointment. Which means, it is better to be anointing free and have a good name. Than for people to call you an anointed person, but you have a bad name. It's not correct. That is why when Jesus died, God did not reward him with more anointing. He rewarded him with a name. Therefore, God also has highly exalted him. And giving him a name which is above every name. May you have a good name. Amen. Next one, number five. This is number five. It says, you shall be a blessing. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Amen. Wherever you go, may you be a blessing. Amen. May you be a blessing. Amen. Number six, protection. I will bless them that bless thee. And curse him that curse the divine protection. There was a spiritual hitman. He kills people spiritually. They are physical hitmen and they are spiritual hitmen. So they sent this hitman against Israel. Balak, the king of Moab, sent for him. In Numbers 22, verse 6, he told Balaam, he said, Come now, therefore, I pray thee, curse me these people for me, for they are too mighty for me. Pray adventure, I shall prevail and smite them and drive them out of the land. So this man came. But when he came, he tried to curse Israel. He could not. Number 23, verse 8, he said, How shall I curse whom God has not cursed? And how shall I defy he whom God has not defied? From the rocks, I see him. From the hills, I behold him. The people shall dwell alone and shall not be reckoned amongst the nations. He said, these people, he cannot be cursed. There is no enchantment against Israel. Numbers 23, verse 23. Neither is there any divination against Jacob. If God blesses you, it doesn't matter which witchcraft, which sorcery, which mummy water, which plants, which amulet, which chicken, which lizard has been killed. People will plot, but it won't work. According to this time, it may be said of Jacob and Israel. What has God wrought? What kind of people are these? The spiritual hitman. He quit. When God blesses you, He will keep you. 
So as I close, remember that this year is the year of our greatness. Our greatness is not going to be based on education or our strength or our connections or disconnections. It is based on what? The blessing of the Lord. Start to Thanks for joining us. Today we learned that the blessing of God brings a good name and protection. Join us same time next week. Have a blessed weekend. Before we leave, here is a praise report to boost your faith in the Lord. Healed of a four-year heart attack. Dear Kapra, I wrote to you concerning a heart attack I was experiencing for about four years. In fact, it wasn't easy for me at all. You replied and said you had prayed for me. By God's grace, I am totally healed after your prayers. Glory be to God. Thanks for your time. You can contact us, seek counseling, ask for prayer, order today's full length message, or order books through the following means. Call us or message us on WhatsApp to 233 55 790 10. Send an email to info at lacrobadian.org. You can also make a regular call or send a text to 233 Our office hours are 10 a.m. to 1600 hours GMT. Finally, write to us, share your testimony, and how this broadcast has been a blessing to you.